When the NYPD reported a missing child today in Brooklyn, we immediately sent Chopper 2 to the scene. What we didn't realize is that it would play a crucial role in finding the boy. Anna Klieger talks to Dan Rice, who's been a helicopter reporter for decades, and says that this is a first for him. Police say the young boy was last seen leaving for school from his home on Avenue P in Midwood around 7 a.m., but he never showed up at school. That's when his loved ones became worried. Our newsroom launched Chopper 2 to this scene to see what was going on, and that's when photojournalist Dan Rice spotted a boy sitting on the roof of this building. I looked down at my notes. I see what uh, the assignment desk had sent me, and I see what the child was wearing. I looked back at the child, and that child was wearing everything that's in the description. He to be about nine years old. Our news desk called the police and Chopper waited overhead until they arrived. He just packs up his computer and his book bag and goes off with the uh, police officers. They looked back at our helicopter, gave us a big thumbs up and took the child down uh, to his parents. This man says he was on the roof earlier today and saw the child. When I went up there with my wife to have co coffee, it was about eight o'clock. There's a swinging bench up there, sort of, and the kid was sitting in the bench playing on his iPad. But didn't think anything of it until he heard what happened. I thought his parents gave him permission to go up there. I didn't even think that, you know, why would the kid, I, I didn't even think why would the kid be up there, you know. I mean, it's, you know, it's a community place. Neighbors say they're relieved to hear he's okay. That's really exciting. I'm very proud of you guys for finding him. <laughs> and as you can imagine, so are we. So to be able to find that child for the parents down in that building, it was a really gratifying experience. We often launch Chopper when we hear of breaking news, but Dan Rice says this was a first for him and his pilot. In Midwood, Brooklyn, Hannah Klieger, CBS News, New York. A reminder that we stream our Chopper feed on our Facebook page. Give us a like and follow and turn on your notifications so that you can fly along while we're in the air. I just can't think of a better way to end a story. I mean, that's just right. Right, I know. Expectations. But it I, usually doesn't go great. It doesn't. Like it doesn't. But yeah. then the question is, do you hug your child first yes. or do you <laughs> scold your child first? Mm. What, what, mm. No, <laughs> what first, happens? First you hug and then you step back and you say, <laughs> <laughs> if you don't like corporal punishment, you might be tempted. I know. <laughs> But good eye, Dan and crew. Good Way eye. To go. yeah. Oh, my gosh.